have a torn ligament, that's a completely different thing than if you've got general achy knee. Hello, I'm Morgan and I'm here to talk about knee braces for hiking. So I've got one on today. I am off and on with knee braces over the years because I've been injured a few times in surgery and da 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 da. But I'm going to do the Tour de Mont Blanc in a couple weeks and I'm a little nervous. So, just a few aches and pains. The whole point of this knee brace is not for like massive support. It's not for having bars on the sides of the brace. If you're at that point, then you probably need to pick a different activity than going up and down a mountain. So, hold on, shadow come! So if you'll see, the knee brace that I have on is, is pretty stretchy. And the problem I have is that just my knee aches on the inside, like arthritis, you know, meniscus is damaged. Some of the tendons are a little bit torn. It's, you know, whatever. But it's not just front of the knee pain. That would be a different thing. But when it's kind of general and all over, it's really good to have sort of the sleeve version versus the kind that just goes across the tendon right there. This is not magic. <laughs> A knee brace is not magic. Some people don't feel any better wearing a knee brace and some people feel worse when they wear a knee brace. So in that circumstance, then they probably shouldn't. You know, it is here to help you feel better. And part of it is placebo. Part of it is just sort of the sensation on your skin, that sort of snuggly woggly feeling that you get because it, it surrounds and puts compression. And so that's a nice feeling. So if you're gonna buy one, you have to think about making sure that like it fits you right, you know, and it doesn't slide down all the time. I got pretty lucky with this one and it does make me feel better. So I'm probably gonna have a little bit longer that I can go without my knee aching and I'll probably be a little more sure of myself. <clears throat> the research out there is equivocal. Some people feel better with it, some people don't. You know, the problem is like, what are we comparing? Apples to oranges? I mean, if you have a torn ligament, that's a completely different thing than if you've got general achy knee, which is a different thing than if you have patellofemoral problems, which is sort of that front of the knee pain. You know, when it hurts like exactly, here I'll do it with a knee that works, like when it hurts right there that's a completely different situation as well so you really do need to find what works best for you hi i did get a pretty gnarly knee injury when that guy landed on my knee in the bed Whew. that took about two months in the sauna to recover from but fortunately was able to do the alta view one about three months after he landed on my kneecap crack the back side of the cartilage, what we do for our dogs. But anyway, Shadow, come, come, come on. This is a good boy, yes. I would say that you need to look into, if you're gonna buy one, Make sure that it's breathe, if it's for hiking, we're not talking about you put out, you need a knee brace just to be able to walk to the bathroom. That's a different thing. If you're gonna go hiking, you want it to be breathable, you want it to be soft, you want it not to pinch. You know, you can kind of adjust it a little bit and use a little moleskin here and there if it's really difficult. And that it doesn't, it provides compression, but it doesn't like sort of jam you with any pieces of metal. If it was the case, then you would end up getting a worse problem than knee pain and you would have a wound. <laughs> okay, so hopefully that sums it up when you're looking for a knee brace for hiking. Generally, you want it to be a support. You want it to be a little bit of placebo. You want it to be compressive. You do not want it to be hard and stiff and make you sweat so much that you get a skin wound or any kind of metal in it that causes any skin wounds as well and honestly 
It's not magic, but it does help. Every little bit counts. All right. Thanks for listening.